Proverbs chapter 8, verse 17. I love those who love me, and those who seek me early will find me. Now Jesus said of the flood generation, they were eating and drinking, marrying and giving in marriage until the day that Noah entered the ark, and did not know until the flood came and took them all away. Matthew 24, 38. They could have sought God early, but they wasted 120 years. And when the flood came, they were unprepared. It was too late. Can you imagine what they could have done with those 120 years? They could have helped Noah build the ark and at the same time got great lessons in wisdom and understanding from the only man alive whom God considered righteous in his generation. Had they sought God early, they would have survived the flood, but it overwhelmed them and took them all away. Now we know not the hour nor the day when the Son of Man will come, when Jesus returns, neither the rapture nor the second coming. We should be seeking him therefore early, so that we are not unprepared. The time before he arrives will be filled with wickedness, perilous times, in which law and order breaks down and evil is free to roam the streets. They will be frightening times. During that time, the ones who will overcome will be those who have hidden the word of God in their hearts. It was found that the prisoners who best survived the inhuman communist gulags were those who had the word stored in their hearts. When the arrests were made in the early hours of the morning, they were prepared. It takes time to memorise the word, and now is that time. The ones who will overcome will be those who know how to pray. That's a skill that needs to be learned and practised. Now is the time. The ones who overcome will have firm connection with Jesus, a tried and tested relationship. This too takes time to develop and now is the time. Seek him early in this calm before the storm.